racist violence or hate violence doesn't exist in a vacuum. It's actually, um, an, you know, it is an articulation of tensions that already exist in our society and that are often not spoken. I set out to make a film about how someone who is deeply involved in the hate movement decided to change and I wanted to find out what what that was that enabled him to wake up and as he says blink and um, and leave the movement. What I made and what I ended up doing um, was finding it was a, it was much more complex than I thought. I don't think the media covers the, the way um, what this has to do with class, uh, what this has to do with gender, um, and and I and what this has to do with with white identity. How you know in white supremacy you can see some expression of you know of assumptions that a lot of you know white folks don't like to examine uh, in themselves or in their communities.